Hello and welcome back to Cool Things in Nature. I'm Coolia and I'm here again in the San Bernardino Mountains in California and I'm standing next to some Populus tremuloides trees. Uh, tremuloides, trembling. It's a trembling aspen or a quaking aspen. Um, you can kind of, when the wind blows, you can kind of listen to the way that it blows through them and it sounds kind of like quaking. That's where it gets its name, which is really, really awesome. Uh, the quaking aspen is in the willow family, Salicaceae. So it has salicylic acid in it, which is like a natural aspirin. Um, so that's a really cool ethnobotanical thing in nature. Um, another cool thing about the quaking aspen is that it's debatably the largest organism in the world. And the reason is that you'll see here, it looks like there's a bunch of different aspen trees around me, but actually they're all connected. They're all one aspen tree. They have adventitious roots that run down underground and they pop up sprouts off of them. So they're all actually just one tree. Bert Barnes discovered this. He used to be a U of M professor, which is pretty cool. Um, another awesome thing about the aspens, you could go on for days about them, is that they're a really good fire break tree. Um, so if a fire is coming, they can bring a crown fire back to the ground. So it's really easy to fight the fire, or it's easier for the firefighters to fight the fire. So this is a quaking aspen tree. Its bark is photosynthetic. So even when it doesn't have leaves on it, it can still gain energy from the sun and go through photosynthesis by using its trunk. Uh, so that's the Populus tremuloides cool thing in nature.